What is up, guys? This is Gamma's HD. Today so I'm going to bring you how to port forward a Gareth Mod server. Um, so, yeah, basically, what you want to go do is open up CMD first of all. This is for Thompson Gateway users as well. Um, then you go IP config. Should load up. Um, and then you want to go down to default gateway and copy that into your browser in your internet browsing thing. I prefer, I recommend. Um, Google Chrome because it's faster, easy, and not as laggy. Wait for that to load, and so yes, you've got your default gateway up there. It will bring up your thing. If it comes to a login, type in admin, password admin. Um, then you want to go to um, game and application sharing, and then you want to assign, I mean, create a game to a new application. So choose your name. Um, of your dark IP or goes on server, then click the manual entry ports. Click next. I've already done this though, so I can't put two ports in because they'll they don't match together and then I'll screw up my original port. So once that is done, you'll come to a screen where it says add in the ports. Um, the port you want to add in is let me open it up on Notepad for you guys. Um, the port, the first two ports you want to add in is 27000 and then for the second two ports you want to add in 27015 so there should be another two ports left open which is normal um, then you want to save that and then you'll get to this up here and you want to assign a game to an application to a local device you want to set it to your computer your computer your hosting you want to host your computer on so at the moment I'm hosting it on my PC let you think so as you can and you just click add but since if you see here that's mine dark IP PC and it's hosting off my computer here so um yeah and basically that's how you port forward guys um then I'll get you, uh, the port forward checking system yeah, then you want to check in um, 27015 but first of all before you check it you want to start up your goes so just run that uh, check and hold on has it loaded there we go port is open and that is how you make that's how you put forward your server on a Thompson Gateway. Hey, you guys enjoyed? Subscribe, please. I put a lot of time and effort into these videos just to help you guys. So um, catch us later.